Hey my friend, welcome to Joystick. In this video, I will show you how to install Python 3.13 in macOS. Before we begin the installation, I want to show you what version of Python currently exists on my Mac so that we can validate the installation later. To do that, I am going to just type Python 3 hyphen hyphen version. If I hit enter, you will get to see the version. So currently python 3.12.2 is installed on my mac and now i am going to show you how to install python 3.30 to do that first i'll press command space to open the spotlight search where i will type chrome to open the google chrome now in the search bar i am going to type python download i hit enter then I am going to click on the first link that appears in the search results, which is from www.python.org. This is the official website of Python. You can see it shows here, download the latest version for Mac OS. That means I don't have to search Python specifically for Mac OS. It is automatically presenting it to me. So what we are going to do, we are going to click on this button, which says download Python 3.13.0. Let me click on this. All right, you can see that uh, it has started downloading Python 3.13.0 and uh, you can see it has been downloaded. I am going to simply click on it to open the installer. And there you go. The installer has opened. Let me minimize this terminal. Now what I'll do is click on continue and I'm going to click on continue again. And then I'm going to click on continue again. OK, it is asking me to continue installing the software. You must agree to the terms of the software license agreement. So I'm going to click on agree. And it is also saying that this is going to take 180.4 MB of space on my computer, which I am totally OK with. So I am now going to hit install. OK, it's asking me for my username and password. So let me enter that. I have entered the username and the password. Now I'm going to click on install software. And there you go. The installation has begun. All right. I think the installation has been done. There is some finishing touch remaining. OK, and it says the installation was completed successfully and uh, it has also said congratulations to us that Python 3.13.0 for Mac OS 10.13 or later was successfully installed. So now what I'm going to do is close this installer and it is asking me, do you want to move the Python installer to the bin? I am OK with that. Let's move it to the bin. And there you go, Python 3.13 or Python 3.13 is successfully installed. Let's verify it. So now what we are going to do, we are going to close this terminal window and we are going to open a new terminal window. Let me do that. So I'm going to again hit command space to open the spotlight search. I'll type terminal here this time. And there you go, a new terminal window has popped up. Now we are going to check the Python version and it should come out as 3.30. Okay. So we are again going to write the command as Python 3 hyphen hyphen version. I hit enter and there you go. This is the version of Python that we installed just now. And this version appearing over here is a proof that Python 3.13.0 has been successfully installed in my Mac. Now we are going to create a simple Python script using idle and we are going to execute it using Python 3.30 that we just installed. So you can see that I have opened the idle shell, but I have to create a new Python script. To do that, I'm going to create on file and click on new file. This opens the idle editor. So over here, I'm going to write one line of code, which will be print and uh, within brackets, within double quotes, it will be hello joey all right now i'm going to save it and i'm going to save it on my desktop okay let me select desktop from here and let me name this file as first python.py actually i don't have to name it 
dot py because it has already been selected here i'm going to click on save and there you go the file appears over here on my desktop now this file is saved first python dot py so what i'm going to do i'm going to click on run and i'm going to click on run module if i do that you can see that hello joey is printed on the idle shell so what we did we just ran a simple python script using python 3.13.0 and with this we have come to the end of this video i hope you enjoyed learning how to install python 3.13.0 in mac os from this video of joystick i'll see you in the next video till then goodbye and take very good care of yourself